Hi everyone, it's uh, me. It's uh, 1.53 in the afternoon, uh, Wednesday afternoon, and getting ready to go to my interviews. I'm all dressed up again. But uh, yeah, just getting ready to go to my interview. I got the first one at Weedman. Uh, this would be my second interview there. And then I have another one at Panera Bread. Um, I'm just now leaving Stryker. I don't know how long the one at Weedman's going to go. It's at 3 o'clock. Hopefully he can get me in right away. Because... If you can get me in right away, then I can hurry up and have that one at uh, Panera Bread. Um, but yeah, like I said, I'm just now leaving Stryker. Um, I'm just going to take Airport Highway instead of the Turnpike because, yeah, it's $2 there um, using the Turnpike. But... I gotta try to save my money, and I. And you can use Airport Highway. Yeah, you have to go through Wauseon, Delta, Swanton to get there, but it's better than paying the toll. Um, yeah, it's not a direct direct route, but it's a lot better because then you don't really have to worry about paying the toll. Yeah, I have to go through. Archbold, I have to go through Stryker, Archbold, Wauseon, Delta, then Swanton, just to get to Weed Man. Yeah, it's a little bit, it's like an extra ten minutes on my drive, but it's no big deal. Um, but yeah, I will leave the camera on for a little bit. Um, I don't know how everything's going to go. Like I said, this is my second interview at Weed Man. Um, I'm trying because I need a job. Yeah, making these videos, it is considered a job, but I don't know how to word it. Um, it's, I need something that gets me out of the house. Uh, I'm the kind of person that does not like sitting in the house doing nothing. Um, some YouTubers, yeah, this is perfect for them. Me, no. I've always worked. And always planned to. Um, like I said, I wouldn't have... I probably would still be working. I would probably just be getting up, getting ready to go to work. Uh, but when I lost my job at Cloverleaf... I, um, basically, I don't know how to word it, but been can't really do much because of my fee, for one. Um, for two, I really can't. I, I need something physical. I don't like laying around doing nothing. Um, some people do. That's not me. Uh, I've been working ever since I was, well, I started in the school cafeteria. I worked a little bit in a concession stand um, back in 97. And then I worked for the city, Defiance City Schools uh, cafeteria for Defiance High School. I did that for a while. Um, started working at Kmart. I didn't... I was only at Kmart for about a year, and then I ended up quitting because of the way they treated me. And then I worked at a computer store, and then I worked at Kroger, and then I worked at Meyer, and I worked... When I lived in Florida, I... When I moved to Florida, I um, worked at Winn-Dixie in Florida, and then I worked at Champion Chevrolet when I lived in Florida. Um, I've also worked 
at Brown's Bakery. Brown's Bakery went out of business. I was there for a couple of months and then they filed bankruptcy and then just last year, the year before, they uh, filed bankruptcy for the second time and they ended up closing their doors. Um, then I worked for several different temp services for different factories. Uh, I've been working ever since I was 14, 15, something like that. But yeah, I love working. I don't like sitting at home. Yeah, I was unemployed when uh, I got laid off from Cloverleaf back in 2010. But I was also helping take care of my mom as best as I could. Because I know that she was so sick that I needed, her, needed to help her. Um, but when I did go back to work in 2013... I I was actually happy that I went back to work and then now that I lost my job I feel like I'm worthless um, maybe it's because I'm not out of the house doing anything that could be part of it I don't know uh, but yeah like I said I, I've been trying my best to uh, keep myself busy and when I'm not feeling like crap then I uh do things around the house. Um, like I said, uh, I just really would like to get back to work. Um, I've applied at so many places and I've had interviews and so far nothing. Um, but if I don't get a job and I start becoming successful on YouTube, that's fine also because I don't mind doing that. But I would really like to be out of the house doing something because I don't like sitting around doing nothing. But yeah, like I said, I wanted to share this with everybody. Uh, I'm just now here in Archbold. I'm over by ConAgra Foods. But yeah, I figured I would share that with everybody. Um, what my problem is, mainly, is when uh, I was younger, I didn't take care of myself, health-wise. Um, that was my fault. Like I said, I didn't take good care of myself. I let my health decline. And I'm pretty much in the situation that I am in now. Um, yeah, I probably could have took better care of myself when I was younger. Uh, but because within six years, well, six or seven years, I've gained like 130 pounds. And I'm trying to lose it. Um, yeah, it didn't go on overnight, and it's not going to come off overnight, but I'm trying my best to lose it. Uh, I know it's not easy losing weight, and for the ones that do try to lose, it's not easy. Uh, but yeah, I figured I would share that with everybody. I'm going to turn the camera off, and I will turn it back on here in a little bit. And I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.